Hi. Bless you. My name is Prophetess Cinderella. Please try or keep on subscribing, commenting, like, and share on my platform. You know, this platform is a platform to win so many souls for Christ. So share for others to come and join. To come and join, sorry. So when the more you sharing, the more God is passing through is to win souls. Bless you. I want us to share something in Judges chapter 1, verse number 1, going 1 to 4. I'm reading. The Bible says, After the death of Joshua, the Israelites asked the Lord, Which tribe, which tribe should go first to attack the Canaanites? The Canaanites. The Lord answered Judah, for I have given them victory over the land. The men of Judah said to their relatives from the tribe of Simon, join with us to fight against the Canaanites. Living in the territory Living in the ter ter living in the territory allotted to us, then we will help you conquer your territory. So the men of Simon went with Judah. Amen. Verse number four. When the men of Judah attack the Lord, when the men of Judah attack, attacked, the Lord gave them victory over Canaanites and Perizzites, and they killed 10,000 enemies, warriors, at the town of Bazak. Amen. Amen. God is good. Just say all the time, all the time, our Savior is everlasting good. Yes, God is good to his people. Oh, yes, he is good to his people. You know, at the time that Joshua died, the Israelites asked God because the, Joshua was the leader of the Israelites on their way. Uh, he was the leader or he was the one that God gave him the strength and the ability to, to, to lead the Israelites to the land of Canaan. And when Joshua died, the Israelites were right at Canaan. But there were enemies on their land that God has given to them. So they need to fight for their land. So the, 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 the Israelites, they ask God, what, which tribe should fight first against the Canaanites? God chose the Judah because they are the people that God has given them the land. So he chose Judah. So they ask Simon to, to, to join them or to help them to fight with them. So that the land will be theirs. And God gave, the, God gave the strength to the Judah. He gave the power to them. To overcome 10,000 people. The warriors. To overcome them. To kill them. There were 10,000 enemies on the land of Canaan. On the land of Canaanites. Canaan. So God gave the uh, God gave Judah strength. The tribe of Judah, He gave them strength to fight against those and uh, to fight against those enemies on the land of Canaanites, of Cana. That's how I say it. So, you know, and God let God give them the ability. 
the power, the strength that the, 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 he gives them everything so that they can succeed to kill all the enemies on the land so that the land will become theirs. I am speaking to you on one thing right now. You know, when you get closer to God, when you are a person that you do obey God, when, when, when you have determination with Christ, when you have determined to roll or to work with God, I'm telling you, God give you the strength to fight over your enemies. That's what God did to, to uh, that's what God did for the Israelites to fight over their enemies. I'm telling you, you need the strength, the power, and the grace to overcome your enemies. God gave the, the, the tribe of Judah the power, the ability, the grace, the strength, the fire to conquer the Canaanites. The, 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 the the enemies on the land of Canaanites, and they succeeded by the power of the Holy Spirit. So I'm telling you, sometimes what is belongs to you, what is yours, the thing that is yours, the thing that belongs to you, why are you living for the enemy to take it by force? You know, they know that this thing, it doesn't belong to them. But if you don't pray for strength, if you don't live in a holiness and righteous life, if you don't pray for mercy, if you don't pray for power, I'm telling you, you cannot conquer the people, your enemies. You need the ability. You need the power. I'm telling you, you need the strength of God. Because with your strength, you cannot succeed. But with God's strength, you can overcome them. Because God gave them strength to overcome 10,000 enemies. 10,000 enemies warriors on the land of Canaanites. So you can. God can give you power over power. Have you forgotten David? God gave him strength, the ability, the power as young or as young guy, as, as, as look at the way he was, a, 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 a guy that can stand with a giant and fight. If it's not the power and the strength of God, the mercy and the ability and the fire of the Holy Spirit, he couldn't. If it is not that, he couldn't even overcome Goriath. Women of God, men of God, sometimes we shouldn't leave what belongs to us for the enemy to take it from us or to take it away from us. We need to stand firm. We need to pray. We need to seek for the uh, wisdom. We need to seek for the power of the Holy Spirit. We need to seek for strength. We need to seek for the ability to fight. We need to seek for the spiritual strong, strongness to stand on our feet and pray and fight what belongs to us. And God, the merciful God, will surely give it to us. After they fought against them and God gave them the ability to kill 10,000 enemies on the land of Canaan. The land became theirs the israelites are living on the land because that was the land that god has promised them that they they he will take them to the land god has promised you so many things but you don't see it whilst you don't see it because there is something holding that because you have relaxed yourself for them to hold it for the enemies to hold it on you have relaxed yourself for the enemies to comp it wake up from your dream pray stand talk to christ let god give you the power and the strength to pray let god give you the fire and 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 and, and the grace to fight and claim what is yours and it will shall be yours forever bless you my name is evangelist
Hey, my name is Prophetess Cinderella. Bless you. Follow all my social media handle, Evangelist Casuale, TikTok, Facebook, and Instagram. Bless you. Bye.